Work is a source of personal dignity, family stability, peace in the household, the community and the nation at large. Work is the key to eradicating poverty and achieving equitable, inclusive and sustainable development in any country. However, the youth employment situation remains one of the key challenges in Tanzania. The Opportunities for Youth Employment OYE project has been implemented by SNV in partnership with the MasterCard Foundation. The OYE project is a regional program that is targeting to create employment for 20,500 youth in Mozambique, Rwanda and Tanzania over five years, 2014 to 2018. SNV aims to sustainably increase youth employment and income by developing skills and capacity of youth, linking these youth to market opportunities for employment and enterprise development in growth sectors that have concrete potential to create employment. The OYE project in Tanzania is targeting 11,130 youth, enabling them to access employment and establish 230 youth-led enterprises in agriculture and renewable energy value chains within the next five years. Na vile na wengi mpaka sasa hivi wameshaweza kujijiri wenyewe na wengine wameweza kuingia kwenye kampuni nyingi ambazo zinaweza kuwasaidia katika ajira. OE Tanzania Agribusiness Project is focusing on the livestock sectors which comprises red meat artisans, animal fattening, dairy, leather processing and product development, horticulture, both organic and conventional, rice cultivation and utilization of rice husks and edible oil seeds, in particular sunflower cultivation and processing. Sasa hivi tunaweza tukawa walimu wa watu wengine wa vijana wenzetu. Mimi nimejifunza mambo mengi kwa sababu hata kuchuna mimi nilikuwa sijui. Yaani jinsi hata kumwandaa ngombe mimi nilikuwa sijui. Lakini sasa hivi nimejua vitu vingi kuanzia ngombe anavyoandaliwa mpaka anavyofika buchani. Owe wamejaribu kunipa changamoto na mitazamo tofauti ambayo nilikuwa sina na isitoshe kuna mitazamo ambayo nimejifunza na angalau itanisaidia baadaye na jinsi ninavyoendelea kujifunza kuna vitu ambavyo ninavyo viongeza zaidi. Kule mradi wa Owe kule tulifundishwa tulifundishwa jinsi ya upimaji wa maziwa bora. Kwa hiyo tulifundishwa na mimi nikaona kule nilipopeka maziwa nikaona nao wanayapima. Na mimi nikashaushika tena, nikaandika barua, nikaenda kujifunza jinsi ya kupima maziwa na hadi sasa naenda kupima maziwa kwa kujitolea. Nataka tu upate uzoefu na mimi nijue. The renewable energy counterparts are focusing on domestic biogas, pico solar products, improved cookstove technologies and briquettes. Huyo kijana ndo aliyosoma masuala ya ufundi huu wa biogas. Ujuzi wa biogas umesaidia kwa kuinua kipato changu na isingekuwa biogas mpaka sasa hivi nisingefikia hapa. A youth market assessment preceded the selection process, ensuring that the youth took part in defining employment opportunities and training trajectories. As a result of this participatory and interactive approach, OYE managed to recruit youth who are motivated and are driven to increase their income and to improve their livelihoods. Sisi ni vijana wa kikundi cha Amboni Youth Group. Tulikutana kwenye mradi wa OYE ambao umedhaminiwa na SMV. Tumepata faida nyingi ambazo ikiwemo kama kuwa na uwezo wa kuelimisha wajasiriamali mbalimbali. Ya pili ni kuwa na uwezo wa kusimamia na kuanzisha biashara. Yeah, na vile vile tuna thubutu na tunaweza kufanya jambo lolote la biashara. Kama unaoviona pia hapa tumefungua ili duka letu la kikundi, tunaendesha vizuri na tunalifanya vizuri vile vile. Baada ya kupata mafunzo haya ambayo yaliishia mwezi wa kumi, si baada ya mwezi wa mwezi wa 11 tukaamua tukae kama vijana wa Amboni Youth Group kaamua ni jinsi gani ya kupata mtaji. Kitu cha kwanza tulichoamua ni sisi wenyewe kwanza kabla kwenda kwenye mkopo tuanzishe vikoba ambao kila wiki tutatoa shilingi 1000 kwa kila mwaka kikundi. In both agriculture and renewable energy, the youth have defined their employment ambition within and beyond their selected subsectors. At the same time, our youth will not be limited to these perspectives and are encouraged to use them as stepping stones rather than end situations. The target group for the OYE project comprises rural young men and women throughout Tanzania between the ages of 15 and 35 but with a focus on the 18 to 25 age bracket. 
Oe Tanzania has consciously opted to aim at local trainers and service providers instead of starting with national level agreements. Ushirikiana na SNV katika kupitia mradi wao wa Oe tuliona kwamba kwa kuangalia mifugo tulio nayo tunaweza tukapata na kufundisha vijana wakaweza kazitumia fursa hizo kujiajiri kuanzia ufugaji mpaka utayarishaji wa nyama SNV provides youth with post training support in order to strengthen their capacity to access employment opportunities in existing enterprises within the selected growth sectors SNV kwa kweli tuseme na washukuru sana ndio walioleta ile wazo kasema proposal tutaipeleka makamu mkuu wa tusaidiskas na vile vile tutaletea matokeo kama itakuwa ina vijana watapata fursa ya kujiendeleza fursa ya kujiajiri na kuajiriwa ningewahakishia wafadhili kwamba hela zao zinatumika vizuri na ili wadhibitishe hela zao zinatumika vizuri ni kwamba tumefuzu na tumegraduate na tunafanya kile walichokilenga The project has been received positively by partners, stakeholders such as vocational training institutions, agriculture and renewable energy associations, farmers groups and associations, government institutions and officials, the private sector and most importantly, our project beneficiaries, the youth.